Today I am going to share an idea for taking photos, photographing your daily life. I guess one reason why you don't photograph your daily life is that you think your daily life is too common to photograph. So you might think you need to go somewhere special to take good photos. For example, people in Canada might think they need to go to a place like South Korea to take good photos, while people in South Korea might think they need to go to a place like Canada to take good photos. However, if you really think about it, you will realize that South Korea is just the place where South Koreans live regular lives, just like Canada is the place where Canadians live regular lives. Another possible reason you don't photograph your daily life is that you assume your current life remains as it is for a long time. However, have you ever thought it would be awesome if you had photographed your life more seriously 10 or 20 years ago, like when you were a kid, a teenager, or a college student? The thing is, today will be 10 years ago in 10 years. Furthermore, even though your daily life might seem similar as in the movie Grand Hawk Day, there are no truly identical moments in real life. On top of that, it can be really interesting to photograph your daily life because you will find out more things about yourself and your life than you might expect. For example, without thinking about it too much, try to take photos of whatever catches your eye while you're taking a walk, and you will see what you are visually interested in unconsciously. Or try to take photos of things you see through the windows in the transit you take while committing to your workplace, you will be surprised how uncommon they look in the photos. So I highly recommend photographing your daily life. That's it for today. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope to see you next time.